we will start by creating a Symfony application. Make a chat controller with the endpoint that will answer our chat messages. Now install the simplest chat widget. Let's make our chatbot a little more smarter by setting up the PHP OpenAI client and getting this to work it is easy and straightforward. We need an API key from the OpenAI dashboard and copy the code snippet. Let's use the OpenAI client in our chat controller put in the message from the chat and return the OpenAI message in the response. At this stage, our chat is smart, but is not aware of previous message. So the OpenAI call need to have the whole conversation every time. For us, this will be easy because the chat widget has a parameter that contains the whole history. Now that our chat would become more smarter, he added an M to my name. Next and most important is the system message. In the documentation, it says the system message help sets the behavior for the assistant. We are going to write a contract with ChatGPT telling it you are a customer service agent that work for a software development company. Your goal is to schedule meetings and meeting confirmation need to be in this exact format. We adjust our controller and add the system message and let's load the file that contains the system contract. And we have ChatGPT answering in the correct format. Now let's parse the ChatGPT response and and check if it contains a meeting confirmation and if so let's forward it to the google calendar api i have implemented the google calendar and i add the chat gpt cursor effect and now it's time to test our smart active chatbot i told the chatbot next wednesday without mentioning any date and ladies and gentlemen it scheduled a meeting in the correct date if this was a little too complex don't worry because i have the whole work well documented step-by-step -step instruction that will pop up with the link in the video i hope you enjoy watching i hope you liked subscribed commented and watched again thank you very much and see you next time